Can you feel that? That thing that's beating your dog on chest right now. Can you feel it? Can you feel what's about to happen on this field, man? Let's go. Gives you for another exciting audition. It is not Jordan, it is not my Dan, but it is the Mad Dan, aka the Laser Show, the internet's most passionate show about John Madden NFL 12 football. Uh, kicking off the bang here, show 154. Uh, great twin last night. We had uh, the co founder from uh, VirginGaming.com, Zach Zeldin on the line, talk about how he kind of built up Virgin Gaming, his background story where he came from World Gaming and was noticed and then that uh, led into uh, how he started uh, Virgin Gaming and then talks about a lot of the other things about customer support there. My big focus, and you guys have heard me a number of times talk about the customer service and customer support at Virgin Gaming is, is top notch. You send a message there, they get back to you. Um, oftentimes within 10-15 minutes, you know, I've maybe once or twice has it gone an hour. And if you think about in the grand scheme of things, an hour is, I mean, this, it, maybe it's like 12 o'clock at night, but you still get a message back. And that's, that's amazing. That gives you that comfort, that confidence to go there and play uh, for cash over at virgingaming.com. So uh, definitely recommend that. Uh, coming up, upcoming news is Battle of the Gridiron Tournament, um, which will be starting, I believe, next week. Uh, Final 256, I will be in both systems on the Virgin Gaming site, so I'm pretty excited for that. Um, but again, just want to say a special thank you, Zach. Really appreciate it, man. Um, it was awesome hearing your story. Uh, hits home to me. I really appreciate that, so I uh, appreciate you having me come on the show again. Uh, quick prediction again. Of course, Pat's 6-1 and one this weekend. 6-1. and one. They're going to smack down on the Steelers. Steelers can't compete. Not even, I mean, I'm not, I'm not even worried about this. I was worried about the Cowboys game. I'm not even worried about this game against the Steelers. I'm just throwing it out there. Uh, but today for the Broncos, Denver Broncos, we're going to talk about a zone beating formation. Again, we're going to take advantage of a pretty unique formation from this playbook, the Bronco heavy formation. You might not think, well, how are we going to flood a zone from this playbook? But we'll show you how you can flood a zone. The same route and same play and combinations are going to be able to attack man coverage. And that's what we like about it. So let's get this zoomy zoom on. Let's zoom zoom zoom. Let's see. I just got to do a tweet. Who's it coming from? Um, what's up, Gibbs? When will the custom when will the custom playbook offensive custom playbook when will that be ready? That's going to be live tonight, man. You can head on over to primaman.com. Check that out. And uh, our offensive custom playbooks, of course, the seminars there. Got a seminar scheduled later tonight. Um, love the seminars, you know. I mean, uh, you get an hour long with us um, to, to improve your game. And uh, once at that point, we, we break down your game, what playbook you should get, um, how you should use it. And uh, I think those are working out pretty well. Let's, um, let's get into this, though. Bronco Heavy is the play. The play I'm looking at here is the Bronco Z Streak. Now, first off, let's just call a standard cover four. And what I like to do is I just like to run the play and see what happens at the snap of the ball. So let's talk about the route combinations that we are going to use here to attack zone. Um, so you'll see I have a nice flat route there by, by Johnson. Um, the tight end in this scenario is on a, on a deep post and then the far right tight end is on a deep corner. We have a deep streak here by Decker, um, which is going to pull the outside coverage deep. To flood the zone, oops, that didn't do that right, but still be able to beat the zone there. So what we want to do to flood the zone here is take the tight end green and place him on a slant out towards the sideline. So we're going to have a corner route, then we're going to have a flat route, and then we're going to have a deep streak. So in this instance, you'll see... We have to read is the, if the flats on coverage to Johnson, then we'll we go to the A route. But the the LB route there was is uncovered. So what we want to do is we want to deliver the ball there, because um, this is a cover four. Cover four is weak in the flat, so you can see flat, 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 flat. Right. So that's that's the idea that you want to do. Uh, now say if they're in a cover tray, same scenario, right? You pass. Now you read, make the read, flat's going to be covered, flat's going to be covered, but now that corner route is open. So, see, it does, I mean, it, it, that's what's the beauty about this play, right? I mean, in theory, guys, in theory, I'm telling you right now, you could run this 
route combination and beat any type of defense in the game. In theory. In theory. You got to watch out for adjustments that your opponent will make, dropping guys, use your plays, but here it is against man. Same idea. See that corner route's going to open up against man to man. You'll see the, the defenders will switch off, and we're going to get an inside lane against the tight end. So, in theory, we should be able to run this play no matter what we're facing and be able to attack it. So what I would probably do is something along the lines like this. Um, I got my blue route for protection, I got my, I got a curl, and then I just make a read. I'm just gonna read of who's open, I mean, and then just go. Um, this is a pretty pretty good formation. And then, of, co of course, you can then just, you know, run with Tebow. Um, boom. This is the quick audible down is, is that run to Tebow. You get pretty good blocking on this play, which, you know, makes it pretty effective. You just gotta, you gotta fight for it. It's it's a it's a tough two three yards that you know you can probably pick up. But if they don't have guys in the box, um, and you know you, as long as you as long as your guys hold on to the block, uh, you'll see that your the fullbacks what they do is they cut up and they fill those holes that you know a guy that could shoot through the line. They pick those guys up. And as long as your line holds the block, like that guy scraped off and was able to pick Tebow up. But the idea is that. If they if they cheat with their setups here, I right, say if there's something like this, I don't know. I'm just showing you what they, what might happen. If they if they if they're showing something like this, a good option to check down here to the run and then just kind of go and then get up trying to get upfield. It's it. I'm not saying that this is the best play in the game. It it's a little slow release, but a guy like Tebow just boom just trucking through that line. This could be a very effective little run. Um, you just got to be able to pick up a block. You know, see see what the uh, you know it's like to if you motion a guy. I mean, you get that guy right there, double whammy up at that gap, boom. How frustrating would that be? You know, if you're facing somebody and you just start running all over them like this, double in that gap. Throw prior. I might wrinkle this in. I don't know. It's supposed to be a zone show, but now I'm just going rogue. Oh, he missed the block there. See, that's what happens if they shoot the shoot the gap, but. The fullbacks should pick that up, um, and you can get in there consistently. But remember, this play, I'll give you the name of the play, and the combinations you want to do are pretty effective attacking nearly any coverage in the game. Again, called Bronco Z Streak. See how you can work it from your playbook or add it to your custom playbook. Or uh, if you're a big Bronco fan, see how you can use it. And as always, guys, thanks for Twim last night, Twim58. Make sure you check out virgingaming.com. Get on there, start playing for cash, playing in tournaments. Um, and if you have any questions about it, shoot me a message on Twitter, email me, aim me, whatever you want to do. As always, fellas, though, we are changing the Madden community, and we are doing it one snap at a time.